Hi and welcome to my OCRA A-Level Biology Revision session with me, Christine. So today's lesson I want to look at the types of muscles as part of Module 5 Animal Response. So there are different types of muscles that you need to know of and the first one we're going to talk about is involuntary muscle. Now the involuntary muscle is our smooth muscle. Now these are non-striated muscles which means there's no stripes to them. They are very spindle shaped and they are uninucleated which means they have one nucleus and this is important as a distinguishing feature of what what we're looking at here. So we have our smooth muscle which doesn't have stripes, it's got these spindle shapes and only one nucleus inside. Now what that means is these involuntary muscles actually are involved in our slow contraction. So they are involved where you need slow contraction to occur and you need that contraction length to be longer. So things like peristalsis when you're going through your digestive tract or if we were looking at our blood vessels and the smooth muscle that's involved in our blood vessels. So these are the types of muscle cells that we will find located and these are involuntary muscles. Now another type of muscle you need to know about is the cardiac muscle. So the cardiac muscle is only found in the heart and the cardiac muscle is obviously myogenic because it is able to generate its own contractions without any signals. However, signals can increase or decrease the fre frequency. It is myogenic, so it's self-excitatory. So one of the things to note about cardiac muscle when we compare it to the involuntary smooth muscle is that it is a striated muscle. So it does have stripes. It is branched fibres. Now these branched fibres means that there is connections for the electrical impulses to be sent along. Also it's uninucleated, again one nucleus. And then we have our skeletal muscle. Skeletal muscle, again striated muscle. So if we're comparing involuntary smooth muscle to cardiac and skeletal, one of the things we'd want to say is the involuntary is non-striated, whereas the cardiac and the skeletal are both striated. If we were comparing the skeletal muscle to the cardiac, the fibres aren't branched, they're tubular in the skeletal muscle, and we have multinucleated, more than one nucleus in those fibres. The skeletal muscles are the ones that we find pretty much most places in the body, and therefore that rapid contraction and therefore we have short contraction length. So when you are contracting your bicep and tricep, they are your skeletal muscles that you are contracting. So there are three types you need to know, the involuntary, the cardiac, and the skeletal, and they do expect you to be able to distinguish between the three. So I hope you've liked this video, and if you have, then please do click on the like button and subscribe to my channel. Also, do check out my revision platform, www.aiqchat.com.